Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. So I hope you guys are having a great weekend, okay? It's going to be an awesome weekend. I can just feel it, you know? Um, anyway, just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. And thank you so much everyone for all of your support. I hope you guys feel that appreciation from me today. Thank you so much for everything, okay? Um, I love you all. I'm so proud of us all out here. Thank you for joining the Soul Tribe, right? All of my subscribers. Woohoo! Thank you to everybody new here. Hi, I'm Mammy Becca. Keep the nicknames coming, you guys. I love them. You can call me Lulu too. That one's really stuck. All right, so Divine, what messages do you have for my beautiful collective? Messages for the collective. Okay. You know, there's a lot of people out there that are going after somebody for being a manipulator, okay? Um, I don't know what this is all about. High Priestess Energy, I feel like you're just not talking to any of these people. You're not. There's a whole group of people. It could be a family. It could be a group of friends. I don't know, a community going after this person, like checking this person for what they did to you. For being a manipulator, maybe um, maybe they tried to turn these people against you. So there's a there's, something's changing here in a big way. Now these people, I feel like they're seeing you as the Ten of Cups. They're seeing you as you know somebody who made their life beautiful. They're seeing as um, you were someone who protect protected these people from some bad energy or. Um, yeah, and these were people that you once trusted, that you once gave your love to, um, and they turned on you. They were manipulated. They were lied to by somebody here about you. Yep, and they're being told, um, how could you have done this? You said this and this and this about the collective. You did all of this to manipulate us away from the collective, away from, I, these could be friends, family. Your name is being vindicated, collective, okay? And whoever was manipulating everyone and lying about you and trying to, like, it's almost like, you see when this, when this magician is, like, waving his arms around, this person twisted everything around. That's just the feeling that I'm getting here. Like they twisted the whole story so that people would turn on you. Well, now those same people are vindicating your name. Those same people are throwing it in this person's face of what they've done. I feel like people are angry with this person. I feel like they're tracking this person down. <laughs> like for real, maybe blowing up their phone, showing up at their house, um, to question them. How could you have done this to the collective? Clarify this Nine of Swords. I feel like um, all of these people kind of had you in the Nine of Swords at one point. Yeah, this person just wanted to see you taking the blame, taking the heat. This was somebody who's all, they're very egotistical. They're all in their ego. They're very arrogant. Um, I feel like they're very much a liar as well. They just wanted to see you constantly, maybe um, in a place of fear, okay, or oppression, definitely. They may have wanted you to feel like um, possibly even, I don't know, I'm feeling publicly humiliated. And this person, they could have put you in a third party. They could have cheated on you. They could have gossiped about you behind your back. They could have been playing around with other people. They blamed you for something or they accused you of something and they twisted everything around. This, I mean, it just looks like he's twisting something around, okay? This is being very manipulative too as well. You know, they, this person wanted you to carry all the burdens here. Yep, they were working with other people, putting the blame on you, 
telling maybe telling people it was your fault for something this is too many but yeah um this is somebody with nothing i mean that uh, to me this is somebody who ain't ish okay they've got nothing they really are nothing they could have been extremely materialistic but they don't have anything they don't have anything of substance that's for sure if they were playing around with other people those people were like um shallow people okay i feel like this person um they wanted to get other people to watch you as well or, you know, they could have said something like, pay attention, because the collective's going to prove what I'm saying. Yeah, no, no, everything is coming back on this person. Yep, this is what they did. They just wanted to betray you, sabotage you, and possibly accuse you of something here. They twisted everything around. This could have been a Virgo. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It could have been a Li Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Heavy on Gemini. Yeah, because they wanted to save themselves. Look at they wanted to guard themselves. They wanted to guard their their own reputation. Okay, it's ridiculous. So they put everything on you. They laid all of the burdens of this right onto you. They went and they told everybody that this was your fault or you did something wrong here or something. It was all lies, collective. And everyone can see it now, though. I feel like the most important part of this reading is, is this one card right here. <laughs> because these people are now vindicating you. Okay? And I feel like you're not close to any of these people anymore. Like, you could care less. You know what they think anymore about you, I feel. Okay? Um, it's almost like you're turning your, your back on them. You're turning their, your nose up at all of these people because of, they all turned on you. All because of this one person. And I feel like this person broke your heart. But who was there to hear you out? No one listened. I feel like a lot of these people, they probably d didn't even come by and see if you were okay. You know? I feel like these people didn't believe, if you did, if you were able to speak your truth, they didn't believe it. But they believed in this person? The manipulator. Okay, look, they're being called out. Judgment. Everybody knows the truth. The judgment and justice. Your name is being vindicated big time. You're the, the people who turned on you are the ones who are vindicating you right now. Okay? I feel like those people are going to start wanting to come back into your inner circle, your good graces. But I feel like we're past that at this point. You know, these people, these are people that you spent time with, that you did things for. You probably would have given them the shirt off your back. And they just turned on you like it was nothing. Yeah, I, what did I say? I feel like there's going to be, a, there's going to be a friend or a family member that wants to come back around and have a talk with you. Okay, possibly a, 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 a feminine all right. Yep. They're going to be like, I'm so, I'm so, so sorry. I'm sorry that I turned my back on you. This could even be someone like a best friend or someone that you once considered a best friend. Okay. Or a very close family member or something like that. People are going to start coming back around to apologize. But I feel like you don't want to have anything to do with them. Yeah, look, on the bottom of the deck, the Two of Swords, yep. You've already made the final cuts. Okay, you, anybody that um, has turned on you in the past, they're not allowed back in. They're not allowed back in. Yeah. People are in regret now. Forever believing the lies and turning their back on you. 
okay yes and that's the truth look yep now they're in the nine of swords energy okay I, these two i want to take together now they're in the nine of swords energy where at one point it was you okay all the tables have turned on everybody now everyone can see the truth this uh this person who um turned all these people against you and put the blame on you they're being blamed now they're having to take all the responsibility of this now and and your reputation is now being vindicated yeah yep yeah, people are saying you're an earth angel you're an earth angel you were innocent okay these people from your past i just heard I should have known, I should have known that uh, something, you were innocent, or you were an angel, or you didn't do anything wrong here, like they should have known that. You could be a Sagittarius. Yeah, and the one who did all the lying on your name and reputation, that person is being wrangled up by these people. I'm telling you, it feels like sort of lynch mob kind of energy is what it, it feels like. Because the whole group is like attacking this person for what they've done. And now this whole group regrets ever turning their back on you. They twisted everything around. Okay, that's just the feeling I'm getting off that magician card. And manipulated everybody. Yeah, see, there's going to be people that want to come back into your inner circle. I feel like your decision has been made, though. I don't think these people can come back in. What else can you show me? Clarify this hangman. I feel like they're going to be embarrassed. Yeah, see... And they tried to keep this hidden from everybody. You know, but listen, the secrets always come out. This, the, the secrets and the, and the lies, they're always going to be exposed. So this person, yeah, their secrets are out. It was them. Okay, if they're the ones to blame for this. Yeah, and I feel like there's a... There's also a friend, an ex-friend of yours, who's very upset. Um, uh, I feel like there's a, this, whoever this friend is, she's really, um, like, cutting into this person. Like, she's really grinding their nose in the dirt, okay, is kind of what I want to say. Um, I don't think there's any kind of fights. So she's definitely speaking her truth here. She's she may be um, having an argument. I mean, she totally gives it to this like lets this person have it. You, see, you know what I'm saying? She tells them off in a big, big way, possibly in front of the rest of the group. And this could be that close friend that wants to come back in. Okay. But yeah, you've got your boundaries up against both of them. You're not dealing with either one of them or any of these people from your past. No. And she's totally this. I feel like this is um, an ex-friend or a close family member of yours um, who's angry because she lost a good friend. You were a good friend. You were a good friend. And she turned against you. And she's going to be blaming the person who should be taking the blame. This, I feel like it's a masculine, okay, from your past. An ex, someone who toyed with you, threw you away, and then put all the blame on you to save their own reputation. Okay, you could be dealing with a, a Leo Aries Sagittarius. Yeah, I feel like th this person was very controlling. They tried to control um, the opinions of everybody else of you, okay? They, they didn't, 
I feel like this person didn't want anyone around you. I feel like they wanted you to be breadcrumbed by other people. They were constantly um, talking about you, feeding people's head full of lies about you. But they're the ones who turn their back. Yeah, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius energy. This could be a narcissist. They could drink a lot. They're definitely out here bragging, maybe talking about you, saying how, I don't know, they're lying. Just their lies. Okay? Whatever they said about you. I feel like this person could have said that you had cheated or what did they say? Clarify this Nine of Cups. What did this person say about the collective? Hmm. Yeah. Huh. Okay. See, I, I feel like they said that you were nothing. They said that you were broke. They said that you were needy. They said that you had no place to go. They, made, they could have said that you weren't able to take care of your children. They could have said that you didn't want to work. They could have said that you were codependent on them for something. Okay, they could have said a lot about you, but in all actuality, you're the star. You're a star. Uh, light worker energy. Um, you could be getting a lot of attention from a lot of people. You could have some kind of like um, public status. Okay. You're very intuitive. You're also very gentle, very um, compassionate, very, uh, very much an empath, very intuitive, you know, um, very relaxed, okay, and peaceful and calm. This person could have said that you get upset easily. They made people think that you were nothing when you're a star, okay? So this person was doing all kinds of trash talk about you. I think they did it all the time. You know, if this person is a heavy drinker, they said even more about you when they were drinking. Okay, well, now people are finding out. You may have um, your own public platform. You could be doing something spiritual out here. You could be possibly even another tarot card reader spiritual teacher, spiritual healer. You could have any kind of platform, okay? But people are able to see you now. And these people from your past that went against you, they can see that this person was full of lies. Full of lies. Yeah, you're an empress. <laughs> yep, you're everything. And I feel like you're being held on a pedestal. Okay, you've got a lot of abundance around you. People are seeing you as abundant, successful, strong. Every queen in the deck. Okay, determined, confident, glowing. Yeah. So they can see this person was just a big liar. All the truth is coming out. Okay, and um, you do have this one ex-friend who um, is saying the most here uh, to vindicate your name, okay? She's, she is standing up for you in the background, but this is an ex-friend who's already turned her back on you. And I feel like she knows she can't come back in. She may try to approach you and have a conversation, right, to see if she can come back in, but I feel like you're standing your ground. The answer is going to be no, and she's going she's gonna to lash out at this liar, okay? All right, what else can you show me here for the collective? Yeah, justice, vindication. Finally, you're getting some fairness. It's behind the scenes, though. Okay. The scales are being balanced for you. Yep. And this is coming to an end. Um, this is a cycle that's closing out. Yeah, and uh, you know what? You've just been through, you've been put through too much. You've been sitting here alone um, while these people just kind of ripped you apart. Okay, you've had to go through the healing of what happened to you on your own. You know, there's been no one around you. And now these people are going to want to come back in 
and I feel like you're ready to set yourself free from all of this. I don't think you're going to let them back in. Okay? Whether they're vindicating your name or not, you know, they're they're finding out the truth of things though, but yeah, change is coming through. Yeah, look, your life is about to change. This is you starting a new cycle. Okay, you're about to get like generational wealth. Um, this person, this liar said that you were nothing and you're a star and you're about to like make a lot of money or hit it big time. I don't know. I, I feel like um, there's a lot of money and abundance and even possibly fame. This could be fame and fortune, right? Coming to you in the future. I feel like, um, yeah, your whole life is about to open up. You're starting a new cycle, a new phase in your life. I feel like you're about to get a new soulmate connection as well that's going to be honest. Someone who's going to be honest. And I feel like you're dropping all of these burdens, all the painful memories from the past, and everyone who turned their back on you, okay? Everyone who turned on you, you're leaving all of these people behind. They can't come back in now. And you're about to receive more blessings here. Yeah, this is you starting a new cycle. Mm-hmm. Yeah. These people from your past, they are going to try to come back in with a peace offering. Or, you know, they, they want some kind of peace between you. They're going to want to apologize. They're going to want to tell you the truth. So I feel like you will get apologies. You will get the truth. But I feel like you're already releasing all of these people. It's a whole group. It's a whole group or a community or a family. And you're like, see ya. That's kind of what you're doing. He's saying a last and final goodbye, letting all of, the, all of this drop and moving forward. Okay? Right into your wish fulfillment. Yes. Anyway, Collective, that's what I've got for this reading. I do hope this helps. If you like this video, please hit that like button. Yay. Subscribe to the channel, you guys. Join this awesome soul tribe. I, you're going to love this soul tribe. We're so awesome out here. Um, thank you, everybody. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.